So what we got here is a 6.5 Doom. Banshee Motorsports. Monoshock. Monoshock. Let's pan out and see what we got here. A little bit of a little go-kart. I got an eight-year-old. I done had this thing for like four years. That was the very first one. Haven't even driven it. And I had it for five years. But I was looking on YouTube. See, can I find this thing? I cannot find this thing nowhere. So I got it. I like the fact, like on uh, Grind Hard Plumbing, they got the throttle and the brake on the steering wheel. I ain't never seen that before. It's pretty cool. Luckily, I had this steering wheel. I bought I bought the steering wheel for this. So y'all took it off. That's the seat for it. And that's the steering wheel for the racing go-kart. But let me show you this steering wheel that came with this. Dum dum dum. <laughs> no repairing that. Super thick aluminum. So, as you might have seen in the thumbnail, whoo, boy, 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 boy. Um, <laughs> no, I'm not racist, but I'm gonna make a joke. And if you haven't noticed it, after you watch this, you will notice it from now on. I always say for the last, like, almost 10 years now, I be saying, why white people always say, uh, yeah. Like, that whole little combination in their videos, they always say, uh, yeah. And <laughs> I thought it was just funny as hell. I wanted to do a collaboration on it. Just do a whole bunch of collage videos. But I never got around to it, so I'm saying it in this video. I don't know if this clutch any good. Can't even get it off. So I'm soaking it. <laughs> I thought that just me. That's just me. No pun intended. No disrespect to nobody. But this go-kart here came with that engine. So I got another engine. I just bought another go-kart. I actually bought a, um, a Murray Mongoose. So, uh, I got a clutch here. I don't know if it's any good. Found a chain. Got a chain. That's the chain right there. I got two tools. Now, let me tell y'all. These are the little tires right here. These are 4.10 by 4 inner tube tires. Just a two-piece two rim, three lugs. And you can get the inner tube. Just go to home... Um, Harbor Freight and get the eight inch uh, inner tube. That's what all four tires have. And they've been pumped up now for about a week. And this thing got some beefy rods. Uh, unfortunately, I took this loose. I got my switch in there. All this is original. Everything is original right now except the steering wheel. Just found the shot today, so I'm gonna order that. I can't see none of the information on here, so I can't tell you what year it is, can't tell you what model it is, nothing. That's all my information. Brakes work, stop on the dime. Just a little rust there. <clears throat> Once I finish fabricating, I'll go ahead and start pulling everything off and paint it up real good, pressure wash it, maybe. Maybe. Only work I have done was I repaired the chain cover. Got some epoxy. Some some 3D filler. The 3D pen filler. That works better than the epoxy. The 3D pen filler. I had to make it fit, then it made it beefier. Gotta do what I gotta do to make it work. Polish the seat, polish the leather. Got the, the original um, throttle cable right here. I had to pull the cable out. This right here is soaking. It had a little bit of rust on it, just a little bit. 
So I just soaked it, you see it around there. I had to cut it off the engine and it had a little bit of rust on the inside to where it was seizing up when you pull the trigger a little bit, the throttle. <clears throat> so I'm letting that soak. I let this soak on the inside. Everything worked good. So I'm gonna reuse that. Huh? I just gotta wait. Let me show you why. I'm haven't made any progress in like three weeks. Hold on. This is why. Rain. Oh, come on. Rain. Yeah, that's a Murray Explorer. That's the Army Edition. That's the Murray Explorer. That's a, a Black and Yellow Edition. Both of them got Predator 212s with a Stage 1 upgrade. That's a Murray. I think it was a Striker or a Stinger. It's a two seater. It has a Murray. I bought it like that. I just need some rear tires on it and a clutch. That's it on that one. But back there is, I just bought the Murray. Um, crap, what was it? The Murray, I uh, just, kilowatts. It's the Murray kilowatts. See, can I put a picture up here so you can see what it looked like? So, yeah, this is why I haven't made any progress. Now I'm looking at this. <laughs> I gotta see what the hell is causing that. That's not good. <laughs> well, my gutter full of leaves. <laughs> uh, well, problem after problem. Show you how I had to make this fit. I got this off Amazon about two years ago for 12 bucks. They're like $30 now. So I took the original one, this big chunk of aluminum right here. I just cut it down the size. I just cut it out of that. I cut it out of that stir right there. I made it like a washer. Because I had to uh, manipulate my bolts. There's three bolts here. This here just to hold the cap on. African sandals. I should be like, I do it the whole. Yep, yep. <laughs> oh shit, y'all gonna think I'm racist as hell. <laughs> anyway, I'm out. Uh, I'm, gonna cut, I'm gonna cut this video off for somebody get offended with my dark sense of humor. And by the way, I am going to try to rebuild this engine. I've never rebuilt a go-kart engine before. I watched Redbeard do it. I watched Cars and Camera. It don't seem that difficult. I watch uh, Rather Be Welded do it to the point where I rebuilt that. That's a 150cc. I built, rebuilt that one. That's a 110. And I'm currently trying to rebuild this one. This is a 90 cc i really don't want to waste my time because it's a 90 cc but i'm still gonna either use it for parts or try to go ahead and rebuild it well i guess i'm bored you enough ladies and gentlemen since i ain't doing no work because of the rain because of lack of parts well i'm out like subscribe comment ask any questions see if i can answer if y'all know any videos with this Doom Buggy in it, or a Doom Go-Kart in it, please tag the video. Uh, put the link in my, uh, D, uh, uh, put the link in the comments so I can go and check it out just to give them a view or learn something new. Please.